Am I the only one who thought inequalities were just weird math symbols? Turns out they're everywhere in real life. Let me show you why. Inequalities aren't just about greater than or less than, they're your superpower for comparing numbers and solving real problems. Step 1. Reason and analyze. If you have x is greater than 3, that just means x could be 4, 5 or any number bigger than 3. Easy, right? Next up. Understanding and solving. Imagine you're framing a photo that's 10 by 8 centimeters. If the mat's width is the same all around, and the total area needs to be more than double the photo, how thick should that mat be? That's an inequality in action. Step 3. Communicate and represent. When you write something like 2x plus 3 is less than 10, you're speaking the language of math. That's called an inequality sentence. Last step, connect and reflect. Suppose you want your storage shed's area to more than double. Given that it is 12 meters long and 5 meters wide, how much should you increase each side? The answer is at least 3 meters. Inequalities help you figure that out. See? Inequalities aren't just symbols, they're tools for real-life decisions. You've got this!